Lawn mower racing started in a uh, country pub, the Cricketers Arms in Whisper Green. Late 70s, a load of people just sitting around a pub and thought, how can we make uh, motorsport more uh, affordable to the, the average man? And they came up with uh, lawn mower racing. Basically everyone's got a lawn mower in their garden shed, and so it would be cheap, cheerful and open to everyone. It's quintessentially an English idea on sport, and only they would think of racing a lawn mower. To be honest, you know. Do you keep the blades on, and how long, how much grass do you cut over the weekend? You get a lot of, um, you get a bit of a ribbon for it at work and that sort of thing. But when you're sort of doing 50 mile an hour across the field with no suspension, it's um, yeah, it's quite, it's quite good fun. There's no money involved, us. So it's really nice as a community thing. So it's, uh, it's grassroots motorsports, as we like to call it. So we've had quite a few uh, racing legends, Sir Sterling Moss, uh, Derek Bell. They came to our 12 hour in 1978, showed everyone up quite a bit. We've had Johnny Herbert, Martin Brundle, Kimi Raikkonen. We all run a, a very much the same engine, and we all run a, it's normally about a 13 bhp engine, all of us, and it's very close, and it's really down driver skill that it actually separates from the top people and then the bottom people. And we have reverse grids, so you have to, if you're good, you start on the back, and that means you have to overtake everybody to get to the front. So that is good, I mean, it is a level playing field. My engine I'm running today is a Honda GXV 340, 11 horsepower. The Honda's got a lot of grunt at down bottom end. Fantastic engine to use. Pretty bulletproof to be fair. Brilliant engine for this. I didn't have any success for a couple of years, but then once I bought the Honda engine and built a new mower, I think from day one, um, for the first four years, I was never beaten in one race. And this sport is actually quite physical. Although uh, we may not go Le Mans style, speeds, it's on a bumpy track, there's no suspension on any of these vehicles, so you're being jostled around from the minute you start to the minute you finish. As soon as the mower tries to rip your arms off, you need to better grip on. So I have rolled it quite a few times in the beginning, um, I hurt my knee, I damaged all the ligaments in my knee, and my knee went up, <coughs> just rolled over it, and, but you learn and soon realise that don't do that and you normally stay on a bit better. The best thing about lawnmower racing, it's a cheap um, sport, it's very friendly, if your mower breaks, someone will lend you parts to go to fix it. And when you finish, you can have your barbecue and have a beer and have a good chat.